It took me almost 40 years to openly share my music. Yet it's taken me no time at all to see the vision unfold and the mission to be clear. Blame it on the confluence of forces, on timing, the environment, or the kindness of people. I received my first car in America because it was given to me by a stranger I met in a garage sale. I received my first notebook because it was given to me by another friend in pursuit of non-profit work. I received my first digital single-lens reflex camera because it was given to me by still another friend who felt it was better in my hands. All three gifts, plus a lot of help from others, have allowed me to seriously pursue and develop visual communication as an option. Photophilanthropy allows me to pay it forward. I have put aside my privacy, my politics, my corporate and academic life in pursuit of creative ventures that seem insignificant or even irrelevant to others. Indeed, I face many challenges in the social, physical, and material realms while attempting to attain this vision and fulfill the mission. It is so tempting to choose and avail an easier path, especially since it is an option. But I didn't. I thought the purest communication comes from the heart, talking to another heart. Now I know better. Photography, music, technology, brewed in honesty, allows me to transcend what I thought was pure communication. Together, they actually nudge the heart to open up the portals of the soul. The path demands honesty, trust, and vulnerability from me. So far, it has brought me clarity, health, wealth, and wisdom on a level difficult for others to comprehend. Now I see life through a different lens and share with the world what I experience. In doing so, the path becomes my guide. Creative venture is my friend, my medicine, and my sanctuary. Sharing it for others is the mission. One of the reasons I love photography is it reminds me how awesome our Creator is. Nature is the temple where I prefer to meditate and communicate with Him. He is the painter in the sky. I only document His work. Nature's processes and designs are never boxed in, nor caged. Every piece, every section, Every drop, every action is part of the whole of the universal wisdom that we often fail to acknowledge or even choose to disregard while pursuing short-term benefits of materiality and exit strategies. The only thing of matter that remains when we move on are the lives of the people and the spirits that we have touched. It's really not about us. All this visual communication work benefits more people and communities than many can imagine or even understand. We should thank the Lord for all the gifts He has given us. We can honor Him by being the best we can be for others. I'd like to thank my family, my friends, my supporters, and even those who question and doubt because they have helped strengthen my resolve. It is time to let the photographs speak for themselves.